Okay, this is my rant today about this Clover Go that Bank of America talked me into signing up with, telling me it was going to be a cheaper product and it was more secure than the current Square unit that I was using. The Square unit I had gave me zero problems and worked fine, however it was a little bit pricey. <clears throat> I've tried this Clover Go. As you can see, there's two of them here on my laptop. First one they sent me, I was having connection issues. It says right here, initialize your card reader, please insert card reader. It takes a few minutes, whatever. This thing's been on there for 10 minutes, still nothing. I've tried this Clover Go on four phones, Note 3, Note 5, Galaxy S4, Galaxy S5. Does not work on any of these units getting the same uh, basically it's just not reading the reader, it's not initializing it, not recognizing it, whatever you want to call it. Uh, called Clover, they said it was a defective unit the first time, so they sent me another one. So, if you're in the market for a mobile credit card processing device, I highly recommend you do not get this Clover Go if you have a Samsung product. Um, I've wasted probably seven, eight hours trying to deal with Clover and Bank of America, none which led to good results or help. <laughs> so I'm pretty much going to wrap it up and take this thing back and tell them to shove it up there, you know what. But hopefully this video will save you a lot of headache and time. So if you're in the market, just shop somewhere else. Do not use this Clover Go.